everyone. Today, we plunge into a riveting expedition shrouded in the enigmatic depths of the narcissistic psyche. But hold on tight. We need you on this perilous journey. Subscribe, like, and share this video with your cherished ones to accompany us on this captivating adventure. Are you drawn to the intricacies of narcissism? Satisfy your curiosity by enrolling in my extensive course, Narcissism 101, Unmasking the Red Flags, Charting Your Escape, and Architecting a Life Reborn. You'll find the link in the description below. Let's dive into the chaotic aftermath of a narcissist's inevitable downfall. Picture the narcissist, once encapsulated in their overgrown ego, now awakened to the staggering loss they've incurred. Before we move forward, take a moment to process this crucial note. Do you feel vindicated or hope-filled by this revelation? Go ahead and join us in this turbulent voyage. At the heart of this devastating event, the narcissist realizes that they've lost an irreplaceable resource, you. This loss reverberates across every thread of relationship they've carefully crafted for years, shredding each one apart. Let's be blunt. Narcissism is a destroyer of relationships, leaving behind wreckage and shrapnel everywhere it touches. In the twisted, deceitful world of narcissists, unsuspecting victims fall prey to their manipulative tactics. Perhaps you didn't know the truth about them when you met them, but now you do. Brace yourself for additional revelations as we journey together. Now, envision the narcissist, defeated and humbled, kneeling before you. They come face to face with the cold truth. They're neither superhuman nor divine, but rather, just like everyone else. Their entire existence crumbles before them, leaving only the ruins of their manipulations, lies, and counterfeit smiles. Countless opportunities wasted, relationships ruined, and only pandemonium behind them. Yet, they must pay the ultimate price for their actions, emptiness, and isolation. Let's not forget the victims whose lives have been decimated. To heal, they need superhuman strength, unwavering resilience, and the courage to confront their suffering head-on. With each stride forward, victims reclaim their autonomy and the narcissist's hold weakens. However, a significant question arises amidst the chaos. Should you forgive the narcissist for their egregious acts, or is reconciliation an unattainable ideal? Before grappling with this enigma, you must embark on a grueling journey marked by trauma bonds, lost allies, and the possibility of starting over in a new place. But don't lose hope. With unwavering grit and resilience, recovery is possible. Let's not kid ourselves. The odds of a narcissist coming clean, much like pigs sprouting wings, are slim to nil. These insidious creatures manipulate their way into your heart, luring you onto a treacherous path of despair. The path of destruction they leave in their wake is littered with broken lives, a tragic scene of heart-trending debris. Had you only known their true colors, you'd never have risked venturing down this treacherous road. The answer is a resounding no. Narcissists thrive on inflicting pain and suffering, leaving a trail of shattered souls in their wake. In their relentless pursuit of self-gratification, narcissists are painfully aware of the carnage they leave behind. They will eventually realize the full extent of their losses due to their reckless behavior. Watching them suffer the consequences of their choices is satisfying, but that's hard to see when you're still trapped in their traumatic web. It's normal to expect some sort of closure. Perhaps they'll acknowledge their vile behavior, but deep down, you're aware that they couldn't care less about you. It's critical to note that when a narcissistic relationship ends, it's never truly over. They're always lurking in the shadows, awaiting the perfect opportunity to pounce and discard you like yesterday's trash. This predictable, loathsome pattern is a hallmark of their character, and they're always searching for fresh prey to exploit and abandon. Don't be fooled into thinking that they're mulling over your departure because they genuinely miss you. These thoughts aren't indicative of remorse or regret. They're just trying to squirrel you away as a coveted resource a toy to feed their insatiable egos. If you're entangled with a narcissistic partner, prepare for battle. They'll never let go of you because they know your value. To them, you're an essential piece of their self-aggrandizement puzzle. Your radiant aura, love, and compassion fuel their insatiable ego. Nevertheless, they don't give a damn about you. 
it's critical to face the reality of the situation. Being in a relationship with a narcissist is like free falling into a black hole that sucks you dry and leaves you devastated. They'll consume you entirely before you know it, eroding your essence and stealing your precious moments. When you end things with them, don't expect them to mourn the loss of who you are as a person. Instead, they'll rapidly replace you with their next unsuspecting prey. However, they'll always be acutely aware of what they lost, constantly comparing you to their next bite-sized trophy. Your involvement with a narcissist was undoubtedly a one-of-a-kind experience, an extraordinary, unparalleled, and precious one, but not in the way you might have thought. To the narcissist, you were merely their source of light, the element they needed to keep going, fueling their ego with a never-ending supply of your emotional capacity and unwavering support. They knew fully well that you made them feel good, that you financially supported them, and that you patiently sat through their endless tirades. But to the narcissist, you were never truly an equal partner. You were little more than a tool to serve their twisted desires. Be prepared because when the relationship ends, the narcissist will come back to hoover you up in a flash. Haven't heard of hoovering? It means they've lost a source of supply and need a new one, and they crave more of what you can give them. To them, you were a substance, an essential component that sustained their vulnerable ego, and they will stop at nothing to get you back under their control, promising you the world and showering you with compliments. But it's all a front. They want you back only to torment you, pulling you into an endless vortex of agony, misery, and despair. Don't be fooled. Don't let them win. Remember that narcissism is a permanent trait. They'll hoover anyone, anywhere, looking for the next victim to enslave. It's up to you to break the cycle and reclaim your power. Do you truly believe that a narcissist will ever confess their wrongdoing or accept responsibility for their actions? Sure, they'll look back, but own up to their mistakes? Fat chance. To them, they're superior to you, and any misdeed is your fault entirely. End of story. But let's be honest. How often did the narcissist beg for your forgiveness and genuinely mean it? Or show any real remorse? Did you ever witness genuine tears instead of their insincere crocodile ones? They had a talent for luring you in with promises of change, like a carrot on a stick. But it was just a word salad that left you empty-handed. In the end, you gave and gave while they consumed and consumed like a bottomless pit. And here's the thing. At first, everything seemed thrilling, since they had to lure you into their sick game. But over time, their response dwindled leaving you to question, was it their boredom? Did they find another source of supply? Who knows? The takeaway, if a partnership seems too good to be true, trust your gut. There's likely a game of some sort being played, and you don't want to be the unwitting pawn. Stay alert and shield yourself from the glare of their manipulative machinations. When the narcissist had you in their clutches, they'd pull all sorts of manipulative tricks out of their hat tugging on every string and pushing every button. Let's face it, you were glued to your phone, waiting for a text or call. But even when they did reply, it was usually a single, sloppy, sometimes even sarcastic sentence. It was almost like they'd lost interest. But wait, it gets worse. They were always chatting with other people, engaged in long conversations, while you were stuck with one-word responses. Why was everyone else getting full sentences while you only got fragments? It's because they've moved on to their next target, honey. They've got their playbook, and they're running the same game they did on you. The only way to break the cycle of manipulation and oppression is to cut all ties with them, or risk getting hurt by them again. You can't stop the terror until you do. Only then will you have the power to resist their grip on you. Sooner or later, they'll realize what they lost as they continue with their toxic behavior, they start losing connections with their kids, colleagues, and even friends. People start seeing through their facade and stop inviting them to social gatherings and don't even get started on those friends they keep bringing up whenever someone talks about narcissists. Those are just for show. But you know what? They can't keep it up forever. Eventually, their mask will slip and people will start seeing their true colors. They'll keep destroying relationships, either in the present or down the line. 
That's their game. Destroy. Move on. But you know why some people can't see they're dealing with a narcissist? Well, there are a few reasons. Maybe they do know, but they're too scared to speak up. They know they'll be subjected to the same brutal treatment. Or maybe they don't spend enough time with the narcissist to see beneath their mask. That's all there is to it. Don't be fooled by someone trying to lure you into their world. Keep your eyes open and your heart guarded. Narcissistic abuse usually goes down behind closed doors when they have you all to themselves, in the car or at home. That's when they drop the act and turn into a monster. To keep up the facade of being a wonderful person in public, they're charming and likable. But behind closed doors, they will emotionally, mentally, and even financially torment you. While the narcissist may realize they lost you, and things may get better, they won't admit defeat. To them, they're still superior to everyone else, but they knew what you were capable of. Yet they used you and tossed you away like garbage. But listen, you've come out stronger, like a phoenix rising from the ashes, as the best version of yourself. At this point, the narcissist has lost the game. While you're living your life to the fullest, they're out there ruining relationships with other unsuspecting targets. Eventually, they'll realize they lost, and boy, did they lose. You have the power, and you're not alone. Walk confidently and trust your gut. Until next time, let the healing begin.